hey guys, thank you for coming on my channel. Please like and subscribe. Obviously, I got a little problem here. As you can see, a little like dumpster diving problem. Not a little dumpster diving problem, a big dumpster diving problem. Okay, this is some stuff at that specialty place. Um, I just opened the door and um, thank God these are okay. I needed some extra virgin olive oil. And okay, we've got a lot of different things here. As you can see, I wanted to show you all. My neighbor's probably not happy about this, um, but they, some of them are just jealous. You know what I'm saying? Okay, people are jealous about the people that get things for some reason. Um, as you can see, it's hanging out the window. Okay, like it's not hurting anything. It's not going to hit anything or anything like that. This fan type of thing, it's bent. Okay, it's bent, but. You know what? I think you can be bent back by something. Finally, he's over here by himself. Look here. He thinks he's, he thinks he's going to sit in somebody's chair in my neighbor's yard. I don't know if they're going to like that or not. You think that's funny? You do? You're a big fat cat because he likes to eat. He likes to eat a lot of food, don't you? He likes, he likes to eat. Riley. Hey, Riley, do you like to eat? Riley. Do you? You like to eat? You like to eat, huh? You're a funny cat. You're a funny little cat. Or not little, but very but funny. You're funny. Hey, Riley. Riley. You're a pretty cat. When I got Riley, Riley this is the funniest story ever. Riley. Hi, honey. This is the funniest story ever. Well, this cat okay made me adopt him this is the funniest story ever he made me adopt him um where he goes he's gonna probably go over there and get nuts scissors and get some three um but um this is a funny story i think i have to tell you all this story because it's so funny i did not need another cat what are you doing get out of the yard i didn't need another cat he goes in the, he goes in the tree um i didn't need another cat at the time I had Bailey and Bailey had had him a long time. I got him in an apartment community because he um, was a stray. And then I had Gabby and Gabby was a puppy. And then I didn't need a cat, you know what I'm saying? And Molly and the other cat had died and when I got ba well, Bailey, but I've had Bailey for a while, so that's been a while back. Well, recently, Bailey, about two years ago, Riley came into my life. He decided that I was gonna. <laughs> he decided that I was gonna adopt him. I had no. I was no way gonna adopt another cat. You gonna get in the tree? I was no way gonna adopt another cat. Oh, Riley, what are you doing, Riley? I was not gonna adopt another cat. I'm trying to follow him around. This is funny. It's gonna be a funny video. Um. I didn't want to adopt another cat at all. And then um, he was at PetSmart when I was working at PetSmart and I was walking around. I don't, I wasn't working at PetSmart. I was working for these uh, Joshua Brown's um, dog and cat food company, walking around talking to people because I like to talk to people and getting them to buy my products and trying to. Um, Switch them over from blue to natural balance because blue was first on the first land in natural balance. And if you all don't know much about natural balance, it's um, it's a really good dog food, great dog food. I mean, excellent dog food or cat food. It's all natural, no artificial flavors, no colors, no preservatives, grain free, um, and they have an L I T limited ingredient, L I D limited ingredient diet. I don't even remember half of it, but it's really good dog food. Okay. And cat food. Well, look here. Lo and behold, there was Riley, and he was jumping up and down in the freaking, in the freaking cage. He was, he literally was. And like, I went over to pet him, and I pet him. And I pet him, and funny cat. I pet him, and um, he was happy for somebody to come over and pet him. He was in a cage, 